Oh, welcome back, folks. You would not believe the hell that I went through getting this game loaded. I don't know what was going on with it. It did not want to load. All right, so we are in the Forest of Despair. That's me, Gabriel Knight. In case any of you forgot. All right, so let's... Yeah, let's look around here. We know that... Did we see this one? Apparently not. Or did we? Yeah, we... There are traces of an orangish mud in the print. Which should match the bathroom. However, this doesn't... It just tells us that one of the dudes... Well, it tells us that the one dude is a werewolf, right? There's got to be something in the forest here with this. I hate mages. Need my graph paper. This isn't even really much of a maze. As much as it is just annoying. Alright. And we see, we got this one too. Or is this something new? Oh, it. What? I'm not making much progress against those briars. Do I have shear? Didn't I pick up? Yeah! Cut him! Go at him. He's got a lot of balls. There's no way in hell I would do this. You bet how suicidal you'd have to be. That smell. Taco Bell. Oh boy. You know, if this was a real Sierra game, I'd already be dead. <laughs> oh! What? Christ! It's a big fucking hole. Whoa! Whoa! I think that's the first time they've you fuck. Something's down there. Yeah. Didn't I have matches? Oh, I have uh, the lamp. All right. Sorry, you have to hold the button. Do -do 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 -do. 
do. I could have sworn I had matches. No? Oh, yeah. Duh. Right in front of me. It is amazing to think that people beat some of the old Sierra games without, like, the internet. I mean, some of those games were just viciously mean. We'll let you play for, you know, another five hours, only to find out that the item you needed you forgot, and you have to reload back at the beginning. Lulz, screw you. There's unwinnable situations that Sierra was so famous for. Oh god, those were nasty. Is that really even doing anything? <gasps> it's... what? Uh-oh. What the hell was that? Did you just spit out a tooth? Run? I <laughs> love this game. Uh, can I go back in? I'm not going in there again. Okay. Well, let's let's go back to the house. Why don't we tell our uh, our boyfriend what we found? Baron. I wouldn't mind a drink, but I have a feeling I should stay alert. What is it? What's happened? It happened. Uh, nothing happened. You look like you've seen a ghost. No, I... Sweet Jesus. In the woods. Hey. Show me. Uh... <clears throat> Let's bring the guns? C can we Can we bring the guns? Please? Gabriel. Where are you going? In there. Uh oh. Wait, where's the medallion? He's he's behind you. Gabriel. You gonna get eaten? Something must be done. Did you see him in the... Did you see Von Zell? Von Zell? No. I didn't see anybody. Only the bodies. But he was in there before. Eating. It's a it looks like he's been killing like this for a long time, using the woods for cover at this lodge and at your other lodge in Alfdorf. I think he stalks his victims to learn their habits and then attacks them in secluded spots. He drags them back here to the cave to eat.
victims are reported missing since no bodies are ever found. Vonzel's careful not to let himself be seen in wolf form. One woman did see him, but no one believed her. Then something changed. I don't know why. Vonzel cooked up this plan to steal wolves from the zoo. Wolves that public mutilations could be blamed on. But he needed an inside man. So he seduced Klingman into wanting to join the club. Then used a lure of sponsorship to set up the kidnapping. But then he needed a way to get rid of the wolves. A way that guaranteed the wolves wouldn't be found by the police. He knew the club got exotic animals on the black market. He'd been doing it for years. Von Agner had built up a massive debt to Von Zell. But Von Zell offered to subtract part of it if Von Agner gave him the name of the exotic's contact. The contact was a man named Grossberg. Now, Grossberg was perfectly willing to get rid of the wolves for a fee. But Grossberg got greedy. When he read of the wolf killings in the newspaper, he tried to blackmail Von Zell. That's when Von Zell killed him. I knew Von Zell was deeply disturbed, but this is incredible. Yeah, but it's true. We have to call the police. I know the man in charge of the case. No! The police would never believe us. Nothing in their mentality prepares them for something like this. Besides, I am responsible for Von Zell. I knew that philosophy was powerful, but... I never realized that someone could take it to such a hideous conclusion. I helped create this. I must stop it. With your help, that is. What are you proposing? That you and I hunt him. Tonight. I don't know. Well, that's what you came to the club to do, isn't it? Hunt down and kill Tony Huber's murderer. How'd you know? You're not the only one who can ask questions. It's all right. I'm glad you showed up. Now we must act. Meet me at the stable at midnight. Until then, be discreet. The others could only slow us down. All right. Time to go right to bed. Tonight it is. What rough beast slouches towards the hunt, it's prey to be undone. Don't, you're creeping me out. Am I? I have a tendency to do that to people. Well, yeah. How are the clothes? I feel like Lord fucking Byron. Nonsense. What's with all the fox lately? Look better than he ever did. And you'll need that extra warmth tonight. We don't ride much in the States. We are not taking the horses. It's too dangerous to ride at night. I suppose you have a plan? We need to corner him. The best place is the ravine. I think I'd better run defense. <laughs> I'm sure you have your own methods. But if I were you, I would keep close. Oh, Jesus Christ, I'm trying to get myself into freaking voodoo killings, werewolves. God, what's next?
Stay right behind me. Okay. Aren't wolf senses, you know, a thousand times greater than ours? Uh, just, just saying. You know, he probably hears us coming miles away. Something. Oh, Gabriel's gonna get like. Well, can he get numbed if he's got his little protection amulet on? I mean, it wouldn't be all that much good if it if it didn't stop werewolf bites. Let's be honest here. Vampire bites, maybe. I mean, vampire bites are. You know, How do you lose him? <laughs> Sorry, this is the tense moment. Cedric! Why would you take it off? Alright, you're gonna like... <laughs> I should get out the dagger too. Oh god. Uh... Oh! Uh... Where's my... Die, doggy! I don't want to get that close. No. Yeah, it's a wolf. Alright, did I fail? I think that's the first time... Oh, God! of unusual size? I don't think they exist. Shit, I didn't know you could die in this game! You try again? Alright, we saw that. <laughs> the door is locked. Uh... <laughs> Where the hell am I supposed to go? Glad to see that amulet did a lot of good when the wolf pounced on me. And tore out my throat. Safe at last. Where the hell is it? I made it to the ravine, but where's Von Glau? Or the wolf? Uh, uh-oh. the hell out of me. Oh! CG Wolf. Alright. Uh, back off! It's 
a good thing that the thing just stops and stares at us. Oh god. Oh, I get this riddle. It's it's kind of about... So if we go up here... Oh, fuck! That's me. Yeah, well, of course that's you. Alright, we're gonna try and take him to the ravine. What the hell? I can't... <laughs> Not quite sure where to take the damn thing. Like, I thought the ravine, but he, he keeps... That's me. ...outpacing me. I can't go that way. Oh, is this it? Oh, this again. I'm just waiting to see if, like, Von Glauer shoots at him. No, no. I think that's it. Yep. Well, folks, uh, we'll, we'll cut here, and we'll try again on the next one. So, uh, as always, thanks for watching. Tune in the next. Thanks for watching, everybody.